even though I'm giving up the Kingslayer, my new helmet has uh, Spike Force and Pale Can Strike one more target. Wow. This, uh... I, I might have to switch to this. It's It's got way more damage. The, it's, it's got... I don't like the ability, though. Like, the ability is... You know what though? I can can I can you change the ability? Yeah, the yeah. Like okay. you mean like you mean like where it says like uh tremor or something you have like a picture with a 1 or 2 or a 3 on top of yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. As I... long as it's as long as the item doesn't have the locked icon right underneath the uh, the type, you know, like on gloves. Mm -hmm. The as long as it doesn't have a padlock item there, you can change the uh the ability but if an item has two abilities you can only change one of the two but okay. here's the thing let's say you change the top item after that you can always change the top item but that bottom white item you'll never be able to change again vice versa you change the bottom one on a two mod item and you'll never be able to change the top so it I keeps see. you from automatically making a powerful item yeah see i like this because it's got quicker reload it's got it fires about half as much but it does a lot more damage but I I, I would rather have the freezing bullets ability but it, it's so much better in every other way yes and I've had that issue too and sometimes you just gotta go with being better than... I'm gonna immediately dismantle it so I don't forget to do it because I want that ability and me, I just plan on upgrading the uh, the Earthbound weapons till I get something awesome. I mean, I'll replace the uh, the shotgun when I find something worthwhile, but the double gun with the storm whip, that's very clutch. All right, I'm gonna summon the old man. Sounds good. I like how I can just run to a circle with you. Nice. Well, at least it didn't take us two hours to do that. <laughs> right, because um, we had my experience in my hand, and you realizing what you're what doing wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Whose graves are those? Just think, I learned the hard way and took a lot longer than you did. <laughs> I know. Michelle. I'm benefiting from your misery. Yes. <laughs> I was picked as a community leader to distribute food I admit I kept some for ourselves for my girls was I supposed to watch them starve? I feel bad for this dude I traded for favors seemed harmless enough I only took food, but they took everything from me. Oh, but you told me you had... Nothing of value here for me but my memories. Take it all. Then go, please. I'll stay here a little longer. This is like one of the saddest side quests I've done. Hmm. I think it's good, but it's just, wow. Oh, oh, ooh. Oh, first thing first. The first shot after every reload hits with armor piercing. Hmm, but what about these gloves? Earthquake increases the skill's base damage. Mm. Holy crap. Yeah, this, uh, I, I really want the sniper rifle. I mean, everything is is objectively better here. Mm -hmm. But the it's like a hundred and five increase in armor for the for the foot gear, and increase in health. And it if a skill damage is three enemies, all subsequent enemies receive an additional one hundred and forty three damage. Wow. For me, the gloves were are straight up like sixty increase in armor, so. And two levels, so let's see. My current average item level is 13. I equip the gloves, it goes up to 14. 
So my firepower also goes up um, as well, just because of uh, the level. Pretty so freaking nice. What's weird is I, I, oh no, I didn't put the, I, it gave me the, uh, it, it allowed me to pick Killer Medic, but I don't actually have it as a mod that I can put on, so I, I would just have to. You have to have Zahidi put it on. Oh yeah, wait, if I it's, if it's from one of the special, the Earthbound guns, you can't disassemble them and that makes me sad. Is it? I, I don't think it is. No, no, this is the one that I upgraded and it, it gave, it gave me a choice when I, when I upgraded the rarity. But I didn't have this mod. It just gave it to me. That's pretty cool. I follow. Um, uh, you know, I, I, the one thing I don't like about this comparison is I can't actually see... I can't you see know, I, the actual stats. I just had a wild idea cross my mind, which I'll have to try after we're done tonight. Unless you don't mind waiting about 15 minutes for me to mess around. <laughs> so um, my my idea is um, I pick up a piece of vendor trash mm -hmm. when we when we go back to town. Okay. Mm -hmm. I put it in my stash. I back out of the party. I swap over to my other character that's level 20 something. And I put on one of my tier three things onto the item. And then move it to this character so I have access to it. Oh, interesting. But I don't have anything that I can disassemble at the moment because all my non disassembled stuff is either green or the uh, um, earthbound items. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, I can't get the Phantom Dash off of this. That's a bummer. Cause but, it's, yeah. because it's a different class, I might not be able to pop it over and have fun with it. You never know. <laughs> I think it's something I'll mess with later, because I want to move on to... Oh, your character's looking pretty good there. Yeah. Mine looks like an actual soldier. Yours looks like a rogue. Yeah, I kind of like it. She looks pretty, pretty <laughs> badass. All right, let's head back to the thing here. I think, okay, we're in the old man's hut. Let's go to the camp. Uh, wait. Our next area is back down in, in Main Street. So we should probably just head to Side Alley and knock out um, that side quest while we're here. How do I check my, I can't get to my quests. Quest map, there it is. Endless, so endless dark. So we're, yeah, we're not too far from there. Yep. Okay. Yeah, I think we can, I, I would say we got time to do this, this other side quest, and then I'm probably gonna have to call it a night. Hold on. See this thing? You can use it to quickly s select any other spot. Oh, that's right. I, th I thought it had to take me back to camp because I'm silly. Uh, so nope. that's we'll just go right to Main Street then, huh? Yeah, or okay. the closest one to it. Uh, oh, I see. Uh, side alley. I, is it side alley? Yes. I couldn't tell if that was actually connected or not. Yep. You'll get used to spotting those things after a while. It's hard to tell. The map's not incredibly detailed. <laughs> Yeah, it's to keep it from making it too easy, but I think it's... I have to agree with some of the people kind of back Zahidi. fired Why some. Why did no one else think to wake the Outriders up for 30 years? Well, after what happened to you in the forest, they told us they were trying to find a cure, but they never did. But if there's no cure, how'd you know it wouldn't kill me when you opened my pod? I didn't. I'm sorry. I was only concerned with finding the uplink. Sure. Got it. Priorities. <laughs> yeah, we'll oh. so we'll, we'll finish up this quest here, and then uh, we'll check. Hey. Oh, it's down here. But oh, you're gonna this, check oh, this respawn. More loot. That's handy knowledge. Outriders gloves. Ooh. Um, yeah, I might be sell this one just be so I can buy something better. But then again. 
More iron means I can upgrade the pistol. Okay. I'll scrap all these weapons just so that I can have more iron. Iron is good. <laughs> okay, let's go into the Cairo place. Alright, let's do it. Oh, be ready for a crazy time. <laughs> Thank you. I think you're used to that now. Well, we're what? Like eight hours into the game? I, I would hope so by now. There's some notes here. There's some notes here. Yep, and these notes actually progress stuff, so you might actually want to... Interesting. Journal entry unlocked. Reach the B2 facility. That was all we had to do in here? No. No. Abort, abort. It's... Wait. Oh, maybe it is. And yeah. I'm getting mixed up with my locations. Okay, I'm t uh, my bad. No, no worries. Some of these, um, you kind of hop from place to place. Others, like you got to pick up something and then you can move to a different spot in the same place. Mm -hmm. But... Wow, we, you know, it's funny, I, I feel like we just got to level 12, and I'm already a yeah. pretty fair chunk into into that. Yeah, we've been doing pretty good here. Yay. Boglands, oh my god, that's never good. <laughs> hey, at least it's not Borglands. Yeah, even better. <laughs> um I feel like my 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 loot sense is tingling. Uh my loot sense failed me. Maybe not. E yeah, it totally failed me. That lightning's actually real loud when it hits next to you. <laughs> I wonder how it'd sound if I could actually hear out my left ear. <laughs> In stereo. Whoa. Special unit boots. Um, I think there. Once we get through these enemies, I think there is like an item in this area. Okay, now let's check the outer edges here and make sure we didn't lose any loot. 
Yeah, I feel like there's a lot of dead space we didn't utilize. And that's the thing. There's not always a chest in the dead space, but it they're really good at hiding shit randomly. Yeah. I have noticed that, because I've walked right past things. Yeah. Ammo. Oh, here. Harvest point. Oh, I got some leather. That's good. Oh, what's over here? <laughs> or am I moving us forward? Not quite. This looks like it was an alternate route. Yeah. Okay. Um, I think we're good to move on. We might be missing something, but we've also been having a good bit of loot. Oh, it feels sure. like more loot drops in multiplayer, but that might just be because there's more enemies spawning. Yeah, I, that's, pr that's probably fair to say. Whoa, you came out of nowhere. Oh, there's a chest in here. Of course, I go looting because looting is more important than killing enemies. Whoa! Some new accolades. All right, let's. Uh, I want to see that you got a chest back here, right? Yeah. There it is. Oh, ammo point. Now I'm gonna take a quick gander at any of the fun stuff. Yep. Hmm. I'm at the point where I don't want to. Oh. Each enemy killed with Earthquake restores 10% max health to all allies in a 20 meter radius around you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Is there any neat abilities I can... Bleed? Heck yeah, I will, I will consume bleed. Oh, harvest point. That was actually a significant amount of iron. Oh, nice. The lightning came down and struck while I was reloading. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> oh, wow. Another harvest point. place to man if we ever want to like min max we'll just keep reloading this area calm down waffle you're not the melee guy <laughs> yeah we could always just like re take the quest and Oh, 
Oh, over here. Oh wow, two blues. Hey, I'm getting a shot up. There we go. Behind me. Oh, one green. Oh, I had two blues, damn. Pretty happy with this uh, with this assault rifle I got. That's All good. Right. There's some uh, some lore. Some writing here. Okay, I think we're good to move into that place and we're gonna have a fun fight. <laughs> oh, this is where I'm it, inside. I'll look for the cryopods. Oh. This is where we woke up, isn't it? Yeah. Oh wait, maybe there's not a fight here. I'm just thinking the wrong way. I found Scarstead. What are you talking about? No. ECA turned him into a terrarium. Ew. Oh, come on! Scarstead? Damn it. I fought with that bastard in Baghdad and Caracas. He never gave up. He was supposed to end his tour of duty on his feet. They are. That's a shame. Yeah, I was surprised how many characters from the very beginning of the game that, like, you get a little bit invested in, and then they're, like, just dead. Yeah, they really... The ECA was experimenting on us. Did you know? No. No, I didn't, I swear. But the Outriders were patients zero. It makes sense they would study you to save others. And kill half of us off in the process? That is fucked up. Oh, she said a cuss. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No loot Wait. here? I find that hard to believe. It looks <laughs> like it. Yeah. Hey, at least we'll get something when we complete the mission. True. Take us back, good sir. All right, going back to camp. You should just take us to the next area. Wait. Yeah. Oh, I need to accept. Yeah. <laughs> I tell you, it's sneaky. It's a sneaky little notification. Right, but at the same time, you know, it's good that if you're not done looting some stuff, that you just can't be pulled. Right. Ooh, Ruff is playing Battletech. Zahidi's truck is in bad condition. I've scavenged all the useful equipment. And remember, Doc will have to ride with us. Don't forget to adjust your mods because you've picked up new gear. So what did you Yeah, find? definitely. No one else made it. I'm sorry, Outrider. But the fact that some made okay. it, but your cryopods kept humming for all those years against all odds. You should count yourself lucky. Oh. Yeah, well. A weapon then flicks slow. We'll see about that. I'll take that. 
Uh, let's see. Another sniper rifle. It might be actually time for me to do that. It's interesting how it's been um, basically... Uh... Gloves and a jacket. Ah, oh, the jacket. Man. I'm... You know what? I'm taking the sniper rifle. Automatic sniper rifle, full auto. It's probably... The accuracy is probably terrible. Ah, but you know remember, what? you can you that. he can change the variant if it's available. You, you can change. True, you might be able to change so it. You. Very very true. Remember when that. I learned that I started taking items that might be I'm useful sorry you didn't find because if it's not, I can at least get um, gear and crap out of it. You know. Yeah. Good call. Let me let me upgrade this. Let's see if I can rather. Swap variant. Yeah, let's go to the standard. And then let's go back. Yeah, then it helped to increase the accuracy. Raise attributes. Can I do that yet? Nope. I don't have any shards. When do you get shards? You get... Wait. Oh, you get, you get those as you disassemble weapons and armor. So I need to level up my pistol because it's so low level. I like the ooh freezing bullets on the sniper rifle might be pretty cool. Fusion blast, oh. Where's that killer medic? I thought I, I guess I didn't. Is there? Is it just like a chance that you get the uh, the mod when you when you? Because I don't see. No, it. no, when you. Disassemble a gun, you get the mod. Well, why the heck here? Wait, did I, did I, I must have messed it up. Oh, no, no, it's on, okay. It might be on something, it might be on one of the Earthborn items that you cannot, uh, disassemble. I might put that on the, I'm not going to put that on the submachine gun, I think. Although, now I'm going to move all the Earthborn stuff, I'm no longer using into my stash to not take up room like i'm not really interested in the slow shotgun but i got something i like better but i was totally planning on just constantly leveling that crap up mm -hmm. but that's how this goes you can find stuff that's worthwhile and you say nope i don't need this anymore i'm gonna put the i it is very tempting to put Fusion Blast on the sniper rifle, but I'm going to put the Freezing Bullets on that. Um, fusion Blast is actually good if you snipe something and there's a lot of enemies around it. Right, which happens a lot. And I'm gonna yes. The, I'm going to put the Killer Medic on the submachine gun. Um, that's good because when they get up close and personal, yeah. you might be taking out multiple small, small fry at one time. And that can make a huge difference. Oh, I can add a mod slot. Oh my God. I didn't even realize. I'm doing it. Ooh. And I'm going to put fusion blast on it. <laughs> Oh, wait, no, I see what I did. Okay, never mind. Oh, I I'm should try to really upgrade dumb. my pants. <laughs> Those are sentences that are fun. Upgrade my pants? Yeah. <laughs> Freezing. Level up. I have got okay. the resources to upgrade them once. Once is all I need. Well, not really. I need it more, but... It would have been hilarious if I could improve the rarity and get, like, something. I could raise the oh. pistols. Wait a second. I just thought of something. Oh, the non-earthbound stuff might need less materials to increase rarity, so I should check that out right now. Let's look at my... light machine gun right now. Gonna go to improve rarity. And, oh, no, no. It's like 41 to 43 
titanium. I think it's less for a lower rarity than it is for a higher rarity. Let's look at the pants. Yeah, it's less the, or excuse me, the lower the, uh, oh, that's right. You can change a green into a blue using the improved rarity. I forgot about that. And that's one way you could potentially get random gear. Or random mods early in the game. Mm -hmm. You know, when you don't have very many tier one mods. Right. Mm. Alright, let's head to... <clears throat> I think we should head back real quick to... Uh... Ranchtown? Yeah, to... Uh sell our stuff here okay i don't have it so sure why not <laughs> oh eagle peaks we could just move forward uh i well i think i'm probably gonna have to call it a night here because it's getting pretty late for me yeah getting, that's I'm true tired. i'm starting to yeah i mean i've been working third shift so this ain't nothing to me right right I'm not used, I can't hang anymore now that I don't work night shifts. <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, either way, I am enjoying the heck out of this game. This is much fun. And I, I'm, uh, I'm like, I'm super thrilled we get to play this together. Because <laughs> it has been... I, I don't Too remember. Long? Yeah, I don't remember if I mentioned it in the last stream or not. But you and I haven't played a game together in what 20, 25 years, something like that. Yeah, Good something like again. that. You'll be Hounds are still scared shitless to come around here. So, wait. There we go. That's what I wanted. I'm going to do an experiment here. Just, okay. uh, so let me find what my lowest item thing is. Can I sell this? Or should I save it? I'm going to save it. Pants. I'll put it in the stash. Okay. So, I am going to buy a real cheap um, special unit armor. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, well, one of the armors, whichever. Okay. I found one I like the look of. Now, I first am going to see if I have the resources here on Z to upgrade this with Zahidi. Mm hmm. So, I need to upgrade my gear. Now. Hmm. So, improve rarity. I do not have enough. So, hold on a moment here. We're going to do my experimentation that I said about a little bit ago. Okay. So, I'm going to go to my backpack. I'm going to pop this in. Now, I am going to... Um... Leave the party for a moment. Mm -hmm. And... Loading, loading. If you see good... Okay, now I'm going to change to my... Oh, wait. I thought it was a higher level. I must have gotten that... My first legend... Anyway. I'm switching to my high level character right now for just a moment. Mm -hmm. Um, hmm. I'm not going to join the party just so that uh, this should go faster. I'm going to rejoin when I swap back to my other character, but this is just me testing, messing with shit, okay? Okay. We're going to find out live if this will work. <laughs> oh. I'm in an area that takes if forever to load. Me. 
it's so beautiful and pretty. And I'm not going to tell you because it would be a spoiler. <laughs> yeah, no spoilers. What I can tell you is there's trees. That's really not a spoiler. <laughs> True. Because you've already seen trees in some places we've been to. Right. So, whoop, now I'm going to go to body armor. Oh, good. It's going to let me take that green item. Take out. Yes. Now, I am going to... Where's my Zahidi? There's my Zahidi. Hi, Zahidi. Hold X to talk. Now, I need to upgrade my gear. So, I'm going to take that green... And I am going to improve rarity. Well, whatever. <laughs> now, I am going to mod gear. I'm going to plop in a tier three that's universal. So. Uh, you didn't find any other outriders still in uh, each ally in close range receives four hunt receives armor that could be good increase your armor for each ally in close range ooh healing enemies afflicted live, with burn increases so your outriders. armor oh Move that'd actually back. be good to use with you hmm. because you burn enemies Yeah, uh, that's a status, right? If they're burning, that's a, that counts as a status. Yes, I could inc I could put on something that increases damage against enemies with burn. Stand tall. Receive anomaly power and firepower when out of cover for more than five seconds. That could be good for me. Seismic impulse. It generates a wave of damage around me every five seconds. Or, sorry, every six seconds in a five meter radius. I just wasted some leather. <laughs> I put a mod on here that I already had equipped. Why did I do that? Sprinting increases armor. In increases your firepower. Well, I'm not in cover that much. Oh, I could actually put the Phantom Dash on this on this uh, chest piece and send it over. I like. Hmm. All right. So if I all right here, so I'm trying to figure out which mod to put on my armor. Should I get the one each status condition consumed by the skill grants 447 armor bonus for eight seconds, and then the same skill but uh, increases. Anomaly power by 49 per status consumed for 8 seconds. Stacks up to 10 times. You know, the sad thing is, I don't have enough crap to actually increase this armor to purple. Hmm. Oh, where's that vendor? There's the vendor. I'm going to see if I can buy something crappy and send it back to dismantle for something good weapon wise oh I can only burr. it's too expensive hmm. that is actually jonesing me a little bit that I don't have enough to buy something of a better quality just to send back you know mm hmm but now I'm going to pop this into a stash <laughs> and backpack body armor. There we go. That's going in. Now I am going to return to lobby. Confirm. And now I'm going to change back to my Devastator, which is already just over half the level of my high level, which is pretty cool. We're actually going through this at a decent pace. Mm -hmm. Now I am going to join back up with you here. To, and yeah. then you... I'm going to say, hold on one second here while this... I, I went back to... Okay, you should be good. I was in the middle of 
switching locations. Oh. So you should be good now. Hmm. I hope you're at the near uh, place of a stash so I can pull this out and right, see if it yeah, works. Right, yeah, I had to switch back. Loading 80%. Good, good. Oh, I see you. You're a disembodied green bar. Oh, Sahidi's here. Oh. Yeah. I, went, I switched back over to the place to talk to Zahidi, like a dummy. Yeah, Zahidi now moves with your caravan. Cool. Um, I get lost. Now, I'm coming over here to Stash. And... Oh, there's the armor now. Can, Can I equip, equip it? it? Guess what? Fuck yeah. <laughs> Did it work? <laughs> yes. <laughs> nice. Oh, that's awesome. And now I have a level 15 armor just from upgrading a green to a blue. And um, it's... Uh, Got, and it's got a tier 2 mod, Blazing Aegeus. So, when I kill an enemy infli afflicted with burn, increases my armor by 230 for 8 seconds. Wow. So, you burn them, I get more armor. Nice. Perfect. And my average item level is now 15. Uh, even See my I'm lowest... Like. My pants are my low level item. Average is still 14 for me, but I think that's only because I have my my pistols. I only got to level 10. I, I, I bet I can raise it to 12 here. I didn't actually check. So next time we can move on to the uh, the, the peaks. All right. Let's see. Yep. All right. We got that up to max. What else? The trousers. <clears throat> I don't have enough leather. That's what's holding me back, because I don't have leather for the for a lot of the gear. Let's see. Well, we can always redo a quest in an area with a lot of um, monster enemies to get leather. Actually, let's see. Let's see what that did for me. Yep. No. Average average item level is 15. Cool. Yeah. All right. So if we here's my question: If we escape out of here, um. So will it save, for like with the with the stuff that you just equipped? It saves every periodically. Um, if you change areas, it should save like shortly after we change areas. All right, let's. Uh, I'm gonna switch back to where we just were at. Uh... No, no, go to Frost Peaks. We're done in that area. We did the all Eagle the Peaks? quests. Yeah. Besides, this is a cool area to look at anyway. Yeah, let's see it. It'll be a teaser for the next video. <laughs> yes. I like how it is like a little like uh, mini picture of the area you're, you're loading into. Yeah, it's good artwork. It The artwork is phenomenal in this game. <clears throat> Is that the tower? Yes, it looks like the cable car's down. You might ask those soldiers if there's a way to get them working. Okay, it's cool watching two ca two vehicles move noise? through here. How about they keep the engine warm? <laughs> 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 I like him a lot. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna return to the lobby. Okay. Um. We can... I feel like there's something to loot here. Oh, whoops. Here, let's. I'll abort it for now. Um, it's probably just lore. See anything? I like to think there's, there's some. Okay. So, yeah, we're in the new area. Um, this is where we can pick up. 
up from the next time. Yeah. Oh, we'll, wow. We will explore the, the Eagle Frosty Peaks. And there's barely enough room for one last convoy vehicle if we get another player. <laughs> nice. Yeah, hey, see if uh, see if anyone else wants to join. Well, thank yeah. you again. This is um, this is a lot of fun. I really enjoy this game quite a bit, and it is just just a delight to have you on stream with me here. This is a lot of fun. Thank you. I really it appreciate fun the it. game with you. Absolutely. <laughs> I I I'm really. This is a good excuse for us to you know we're like three hours apart at this point, so it's it's difficult to make that uh, journey, but you know. We got the next best thing here. We get to stream together, so that makes yes. me feel happy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, me too, man. Oh man, our characters have like the same pants. I love it. They look pretty cool. I'm pretty happy with those guys. Yes. All right. Well, uh, thanks to everyone who swung by the stream here and uh, checking us out and coming along with us for the ride. Much appreciate all the support. Tarima, again, thank you for swinging by and chatting and then uh, for the host. Always appreciate it. And uh, we will be back. Tomorrow is going to be the dad stream with uh, Radiant Historia, the perfect chronology edition. Um, and hopefully, again, sometime within uh, next week's probably going to be a, a, a lack of streaming week because we are going on vacation and I will have very limited access to internet and computers so I, I next week probably won't work for outriders but uh, we should definitely think about the, the 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 following weekend and see if we can we can do this again you know provided your schedule lines up for us again but um but yeah my schedule is weird it's very <laughs> weird but we'll, we'll play it by ear we'll definitely because uh, i mean this this uh this the outrider stream's not going anywhere for sure we're, we're definitely gonna keep blowing through this game here because this is just too much fun uh, yeah, well, and Go ahead. we get to make it last even longer by doing different uh, class type combinations too. Yeah, I mean this is definitely one we can go the distance on for sure, and I'm looking forward to it. So thank you again, thank everyone, and uh, we will see you all on the next one. Thank you very much. Have a great night, everyone. Peace out. <laughs>